Hello and welcome to DLC Quest. It's a little indie game or disorder download. Get us away from mainstream games and their stupid ways of making us buy DLC. <laughs> and this game mocks it, so I thought, yeah, let's fucking do this. <laughs> I don't know what the story is. Bad guy. Nice retro music. And a retro scenario, like a princess being stolen. Motivation. Welcome to DLC Quest. You might notice some missing features like animation sound and moving left to right. Nothing a little DLC can't solve. Talk to the shopkeeper. And where is the shopkeeper? Does music stop? That bad guy just stole Princess McGuffin. <laughs> you have to rescue her. Okay. Also, he murdered your uncle. You must get revenge. I think he might have peed in the town's water supply too. What hasn't he done? That seems a bit less important now. Buy some DLC and get going. You need it. Alright, let's get that. I don't have enough. Uh, let's get the movement pack. Done. I see the audio's gone because I have to buy it. Now this is actually mocking games pretty good and I like it because <laughs> I hate it when you buy a game and then like you just paid out like 40 to 45 pounds or whatever dollars to for a game and it doesn't come with everything that you expected it to like I don't know say a fighting game that doesn't come with all the characters that you like so you kind of get my uh, what I'm on about there <laughs> And as for games needing DLC, this new stupid thing of turning fighting games into free to plays is ridiculous. <laughs> it just fucking annoys me because you got you buy the game and none of the characters are gonna be there. Well, let's get the music back. And the animation pack. And the pause menu. Everything apart from the horse. These used to come standard. <laughs> but yeah, fighting games now are now uh, free to plays. Let's take Tekken for example. Thick bushes can be cut with a sword. Do I have one of them? Oh, I have to DLC it. Now, my where, my, now where will I find a sword? I can talk to this horse? Nay. Nee. Alright, that'll do. Who's this guy? Someone that I can't talk to, because I need the DLC for it. Yes, sir. How about- WHAT?! Oh, 10 plus nice. I've actually got to press it that many times. Oh, is it trolling me here? Alright, fuck that. Ooh, village elder, I'm guessing. Hope nobody attacks my sheep. <laughs> Shepherd. Anyway. Yeah, how do I don't attack? Alright, I'm gonna have to look at the options because I fucked around on. Uh. G. Or was he actually being serious about the turning it 10,000 times? Yeah, anyway, back to free-to-play fighting games. Like, Tekken, the new Tekken that's coming out. Tekken Revelations. There is no revelation. Um, it's fucking stupid, because it's the exact same as Tekken Tag Tournament 2. Same characters that are on it. Same music. Same layout, everything, um, and uh, you're probably thinking, well, it's free to play, so nothing to complain about, 
yeah, it's free to play, but all the decent characters that you actually want, they're fucking, you gotta pay for them. And it's just Tekken Tag Tournament 2 condensed to rip people off. And Dead or Alive Ultimate 5, the exact same thing. I've got the full game of that, I've got every character, I've bought it from a shop, and then they're trying to re-release it as a free-to-play. Why they say, no, why um, do they fucking, what's it called, sell it, I can't cut my trees. Yeah, so why are they making it so you have to, it's a free-to-play and you have to buy the characters? Because new people to the game might not know what character pick, so they're reducing it for... So you don't have to, like, oh, let's be this one, let's be this one. Do I really have to do this? Alright, I ain't doing that. I can't be fucked. This isn't breaking your emotion, is it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> what do I do with this sheep? Nothing. But yeah, this game is just helping me get my point across, I guess. That free to play fighting games are gonna be the fucking dumbest idea so don't even bother buying them if you do then you're just gonna get mugged and I'm being honest so yeah I've bought free to play games like well I haven't bought a free to play game obviously but I downloaded um, DC Universe and I bought DLC and that's kinda different not what's that Warning reports of strange encounters in the air. Well, I've got nothing to combat myself. Oh, who's this guy? Hi. Dun dun dun! What was that? Whenever I encounter someone, the screen does that. Sorry. Can you let me pass? Never. Psychological warfare pack unlocked. And he wasn't lying about me trying to get past. Alright, we know your shit. Yeah, anyway, so I bought DLC for uh, DC Universe online before, but even then, I feel robbed. And I think I've actually got to do this shit. So, yeah, I'm just going to pause it and come back in a bit. When I've done 10,000 presses of this fucking shit. <laughs> so, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next one. Goodbye.